fake, fake records, 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 records. Uh. What's going on? This is Joey Styles back up in the building with another Ask Styles question. Uh, the Styles question today is How do I get him to see his children? Um, let me give you a quick background information about me. I've been a father for five years. Um, uh, I've dealt with kids for a little while. Um, I also dealt with a lot of people who don't want to see their children at all. Um, what I'll tell you is, is that um, the first thing you have to realize is that if he truly wants to see these kids and he truly loves these children, then it shouldn't be a problem for him to see them. Now, if the problem is uh, a stressful situation in a household where y'all don't get along, he doesn't go over there because of you. Stop creating excuses. Stop making an environment, a stressful environment, where he can't come. Make sure that your end is clear. Don't be like, oh, he come over and I be like, oh, I don't want you to come over here messing with these kids and all that stuff. I got my new man and all that. Don't do that. Because when you do that, he's going to quickly say, it's your fault. You know, you don't want to make it your fault why he's not coming to see his children. You want him to be able to come over, have access to the kids, and have no problem. Now, he doesn't come because there's no drama, no man around, nothing. There's, or there's a straight path between him and his children, and he's not walking down that line. Then you can pretty much blame him. <laughs> you know, if that's the case, and he just doesn't want to see these kids, you should start looking for another person. First of all, ladies... I know, you know, a lot of guys sit there and tell y'all, oh, you'll never find a man like me. And, and First of all, let me give you a little hint. We live in America again. The land of the brave. There are millions of people. <laughs> not just not, look, millions of people. Um, there are people who like one-legged women. There are people who like, you know, paraplegic women. Seriously. There are people who like women with a thousand kids. There are people who like women with no kids. There is a man for you. Don't ever let anyone make you feel like you're not um, desirable. You are. That's the first thing. Um, second of all, if he doesn't want to see his kids, he's pretty much a deadbeat. Um, find somebody that will help you with your children. Uh, the first thing I would do is I would pray. Um, the reason why I would pray, I would pray to the Father, Jesus Christ who saved me. I would pray to him and say, and ask him, Lord, please send me someone to help with my kids and help me with my life. But like I said before, make sure your end is clear. Make sure that you're not preventing, because the email does sound like you're preventing him from seeing them. Make sure you're not the stumbling block, because you'll get blamed for it, and it'll just turn back on you. It won't, um, it won't seem like he's not doing his duty as a as a man. It would just be, it would seem like you're preventing him. So. Make sure you, you know the difference between um, stopping someone, making it hard for someone, and make sure you know the difference in, between someone not wanting to see them or someone just avoiding you. <laughs>